Hey Dreamers, and welcome to the demo of an upcoming game on Steam called Strashna 2. In this game, we play as a painting restorer and we get called to, I guess, fix up some paintings in this person's mansion. But also, this game looks heavily inspired by Layers of Fear and Amnesia. So if you like either of those games, Consider giving this one a watch and see if you like it for yourselves. But uh, without further ado, let's jump right in. Oh, microphone. Hello. All right. So, do you please write your name for the credits? Sure. Oh, I didn't know I had to use this, but M <laughs> R capital D R. -E oh, it's all capitals anyway. Oh, why are you like give me the option if it don't? Not gonna matter. Never mind. It changed it there. My name is Mr. Dreaming. Welcome. Hey, Mike. It's me. Um, so I got an invitation to uh, uh, from this artist to come to his mansion to work on a restoration project, right? The place is stunning, just surrounded by nature. It's so quiet here. It's like the whole world has slowed down. But, um, I don't know. There's something off. Great voice acting so I don't far. Know. I don't know what it is specifically, but something's giving me the chills. I'm okay, going to well, try to dig deeper to see what's going on. Turn around uh, and go home. Yeah, I don't know. just wanted to send you a message. Anyway, uh, wish me luck. Well, at least, you know, we got contact with somebody, maybe, uh, if they heard the message. And uh, maybe we're not going to die alone in the mansion. We'll see. Drashna 2. I... Is that a different language? Maybe Russian? Not sure. Oh, I'm a little bit lost already. I guess that's... Which way am I going? I got turned around so quick. I guess that's... Starring Mr. Dreaming? That's pretty cool. What the? What was the Minecraft dropping item noise was that? Press G to focus? Probably the owner went somewhere for a minute, a couple years ago. And he never came back? Alright. The enigmatic artist. In the heart of a mysterious forest, a talented artist creates eerie masterpieces. His frightening paintings depicting scenes of darkness and despair have captivated the curiosity of many. Despite numerous attempts to reveal his identity, the elusive artist remains hidden, shrouded in the dense foliage of the forest. The existence of a mysterious artist fuels the imagination, making us wonder about the genius of these frightening works of art. Very cool. We got a picture, I guess, the... Uh... Yeah, who drew that? Because it looks awesome. I love this art style. That's some Tim Burton style of art there. Wild nature. Nature is calling. Uh, well, there's no bathrooms around, so I'm screwed. Oh, it was G to focus, right? Can I just do that anytime? Voice events. You can make a short recording using your voice. This does not affect gameplay and is added for entertainment purposes. That is actually really cool. Let me see what how it works. So do I just say whatever I want? You called into a random radio show. Could you say something for the listeners? Sure. Hey, everybody listening right now. I'm just going to go ahead and say that if you're listening to this, you can hear me. Your ears are massive. That's all I had to say. Damn it. Okay, hold on. Let me try that again. Anybody listening right now. I need to tell you something really important. Your ears are massive. So big. Get out of here. <laughs> I don't know. I guess. All right. Done. So what's the point of that? Oh. Wait, did it not record? I have to do it again? No. Uh. Your ears. Huge. Very red. Swollen. Like a boo-boo. Oh, no. All right, let's keep that. Just say done and then leave. I don't know what that does. Why are you up there? And why are you up there? What the? All right, actually got me. A little bit of spookiness there. Cool voice event, though. Why does it say V? I guess it's just an arrow. That makes sense. Welcome to the Gordon Baker Radio Hour, where we bring you the best tunes to keep you Heck yeah. the misty weather. The fog hangs in the air like a mysterious veil, giving everything an otherworldly feel. So sit back, relax, and let my voice be your guiding light. Oh, okay. we have a call coming in. You're on GNSFM with Gordon Baker. 
This is Alan Wake. Huge, very red, swollen like a boo boo. Oh no. That's hilarious. What was that? <laughs> oh. That concludes our program today, folks. But first, some music. What? That is so cool. I don't see why, but I love it. That's great. That keeps me keeps me wanting to uh, make more funny stuff. That's awesome. Okay, we got a random doll there. In the hazy realm of misty air, fog's gentle touch whispers without care. A veil of mystery, secrets it shares, enshrouding all with a quiet affair. That reminds me of someone else that had an affair. This is what I look like every morning. Bro, what is this comedy? What the heck? This is awesome. Is this Sackboy? Yep, yeah, that's how, how he is now. He's dead. That robot guy took over. He got, looks like he's seen a lot. Man, is this Dev, like my best friend? What's going on here? He's got the greatest sense of humor I've ever seen. No comment on this bear, though. He's got the sickest pants. Come on, now. Give the guy a compliment. Alright. I keep hearing crackling, and I don't like it. I didn't expect a loading screen for such a small little building. Oh, is this the... It's a magic manor? How did I get in here? Nah, you're not getting me with that nonsense. We can record something else. No candy in there. All right, what should I record this time? I can say literally anything. Uh, can you voice the monster? Okay, so we do have a different cue. Um. Eater, 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 eater. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, uh, the monster is gonna sound stupid now. Hell yeah, dude. Like you, you can't put that in there. Expect me to be all serious about it. Why is there a big old tree in here? Also, now that I, hello, Grandma. It's like you've seen it a lot too. Um. Yeah, so there's going to be a monster, is what I was going to say. <laughs> Alright. Okay, man. You guys need to stop running around like you own the place. You probably do, but stop. The that is terrifying. Oh, it's moving. It's like holographic. Ah, I love it. Dude, that's so weird. That is my favorite part of the game so far. Except for the radio stuff. I don't know why. It just looks really cool. Tonight, I thought I heard one of the paintings breathing. Well, it's probably that one. So, throw it out. Don't keep it. I can't wait to hear the monster. <laughs> Left control to crouch. Oh, it's a, it's a hold to crouch. Fine. I could probably change that in the menu, but... Meow! So, the cat went in there. I guess, is what you're trying to tell me. Lots of things to lots of things to uh, investigate is what I was gonna say before somebody decided to walk around and interrupt me. Why is so many trees in here? How did this happen? I don't think I need to inspect every single one of these, but I like this thing. It's Halloween. Mm, meow. <laughs> I I could draw this. It makes me happy. Uh. Not, not this one. This one's a little masterpiece, but... Oh, well. Man, I, I don't know why this game is so funny. I love every second of this right now. It's not even scary. It's just making me laugh the whole way through. For some reason, that feels like that's oh, straight out Alan Wake. What the heck? Okay, let me move so that subtitle doesn't happen. The Legend of the Abandoned Library. To this day, the legend lives on. Capturing the imagination and sending shivers down the spine. The abandoned library continues to stand like a silent guard, its doors tightly closed, as if protecting its sinister secrets from prying eyes. And the question remains, does the monster really exist in its abandoned chambers? Uh, we're probably going to find out very soon. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. This is what i got to look at, right? What's this? Can I... Turn that off. It's not even hot in here. Oh, Scarecrow boy. I can literally interact with everything. It's insane. Okay, I'm not going to pick these up, though. Wait, so another, another note here, it looks like. Another photo. 
Okay. Doesn't look like it's AI generated, so that's good. Uh, is there something I need to do? Crank the handle, pull the thing, do another squiggly and pumpkin. Huh? Track one. Okay. Turn this. Oh my goodness. This is... This is hard to turn! <laughs> I have to use my whole arm to move the mouse. How far do I have to go with it? Oh, that's it. Okay, and then use this. And this guy. Hey, go down. Am I not supposed to... Oh, I... All the way. Okay. And then what? I think there was one more step. There we go. Never mind. Okay, well, I got music in the background now. Can I exit this thing? Thanks. All right, well, now I got some jams to keep us company while I get scared. The mask I used to wear is now becoming my face. I like that. That's cool. I like everything so far, it seems like. No, no downsides. So what am I doing here? Can I turn this off? I don't think I can. Okay. Cool. So, it's in Meow. Oh. Oh, a door. Voila! Thank you, cat picture. That was a nice little melody. Have I looked at this one? Yes, I have. Oh, I don't like that. Ooh. There's a door behind me. Hey, uh, I was supposed to restore paintings, but none of these seem like they're not done, so... That's very Layers of Fear-esque, as I said. <laughs> I turned it into a different... Life is just a fleeting canvas. Just colorful splashes on the wall of existence. And yet in his fragmented brushstrokes, I find beauty. Tragedy. A masterpiece of human existence. Okay, I gotcha. And it teleported me somewhere else. Maybe that's just a level transition, but a monster is hunting here, you. Be careful. Here, here, here. Here, 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 here. What? Hey! Here, 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 here. Here, here, here. That's hilarious, but I like. Okay, what is that? Ear, ear! <laughs> That's so good! Ear, 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 ear! <gasps> oh! Ear, ear, ear. Oh god! Stop! Ear, ear, Bro, slow down! Ear! ear. <laughs> Stop! Ear, 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 ear! I need another fuse. That's so stupid! I hate hearing myself! Stop! I love it though. Oh, he's quite fast. Oh, there we go. Don't look at that! I gotta go over there! Get out the way! Oh. Ah! No! Ow! You hit me! Ah! Stop! I thought it was an insta kill. I panicked. Oh god! Stop! Here! 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 Ah, uh, you're stuck, silly boy. Go! Just go! Ooh. Oh, that was that was that was scary. That elevated it. Well, not so much with the ear, but everything else was scary. It sounds like another monster now. Can I go back in here? I don't want to be in here anymore. Mommy. I'm not your mother. What is that? Ooh. All right, Satan's here. Here we go. 
I mean, there's like 100 crosses here. I don't know why this specific one is uh, better than the rest, but here we go. Press 1 to take the crucifix. I now have a crucifix, and I'm armed and dangerous. Can I have this too, please? I would like... Oh, I have a flashlight, I guess. Is that the Wall of Flesh from Terraria? Can I change what the monster sounds like? No, I can't. Oh, oh well. That's okay. Well, thank you, crucifix. I appreciate you. Oof! Would, that, would this have worked against the monster out there as well? Oh, there's another thing there. I could change something else. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Coffee tastes better than tea. Cats are better than dogs. I got a UV stick. Hmm? Secrets of the old mine. The old mine has been a source of fascination and fear for many years. Many locals report hearing unexplained sounds echoing from its depths. Some say that it is the wind playing. But others are convinced that something otherworldly is involved here. According to local legend, the mine is haunted by the spirits of miners who met their deaths in its tunnels. Could these ghostly figures be the cause of the eerie sounds? Or is there a more rational explanation for this phenomenon? I don't know. You tell me. I'm just here, man. Just... I want pizza. Me too. Do the aliens have pizza? Probably do. Will you surprise Gordon Baker? I already forgot who that is, but um, I don't know what to say. <laughs> that's, a, that's such a difficult one. What the? Um, surprise! There you go. I surprised them. I love how these pictures move on by themselves. That's super neat. Another really cool art style. So why is the monster on the bed? If there's one under. Is that... Uh, two monsters? Got a music box thing here. Oh, another... Oh. Not, not even close. I love... The melodies are really nice. I don't know if that's important. Oh, wait, wait. We got another track. I don't need to play it though, do I? I <laughs> might be another. Um... Oh no, it's uh, reveal another door for me, maybe. Maybe I had to do that before. What's with these chairs, huh? Hey, that microphone's gone. Oh, I saw a person for a second. I gotta play track two to make more progress. Maybe that'll make another door appear. Who knows? Track two. Okay. I guess I have to. I uh, this is probably my least favorite part because it's very difficult to Never mind. I now know that you can just move your mouse uh in a circle and it works. Never mind. Don't mind me. I'm going to Actually, I have to do this first, I think. Again, you could just Okay, so you can constantly move your mouse and it registers as the as your movement. Okay. I'm just a silly boy then. Don't mind me. All right, so why did I do that? Oh, hello, doll. How are you? Is there anything else that I need to know before you murder me? Can I leave? Actually, that sounds like a great plan. Get out of here. Damn it. <laughs> it's no such luck. I had to try, okay? Gotta try at least once. Can I go back in here? Oh, the handle's gone. So maybe there's another photo that'll show me the way. Maybe I just have to look around this room again. And I, I thought I heard... Oh, that's the same thing. <laughs> I thought it was something different. Was this going to tell me where to go again? or No, that's the same. That is the same. So something has to... Mean something now, right? Were these guys always here? I don't remember seeing these guys. This mug is also suitable for tea, but I would try pouring fish oil into it. Why would you do that? That sounds gross. Who broke my record? Or is that over? 
Okay, I don't think this actually is important now. Let's just exit. There's gotta be something. That lets me leave, right? Probably missed something in the other room, but he... Yeah, I don't like that. Hey, maybe it does work. Okay, maybe the track is the answer. I honestly don't know. <laughs> Gotta lay off the cigarettes, man. That's what it does. 500 cigarettes. Did you just cough? Bless you. This is Gordon Baker. And you're oh, it's, oh, it's the radio guy again. Okay. It's time to lose yourself in the magic of the night. We have a caller. Gordon Baker Radio Hour. Remember, even in the darkest night, there's always a star shining brightly, waiting to be discovered. And here's another call. You're on GNSFM with Gordon Baker. Surprise! I think we are... <laughs> okay, that one was better than the first one. You like that? Gordon Baker signing off. That's awesome. What a neat little touch. And it doesn't take away from the game either. I'm still, like, horrified by all this stuff, so that's cool. Cool. Uh, your fear is their power. Well, I'm not, like I said, I'm not terrified. I'm, I'm spooked a little bit, but all right, I guess this is a, another transition towards Monster Land, so here we go. I'd rather go to Candy Land. That's way more pleasant, but that'll for what I have. Ah, the crushing weight of loneliness and isolation. Have you ever felt it? The feeling of being adrift in a sea of faces, but completely alone. I feel it every waking moment. My brush strokes bleeding onto the canvas. I guess this is the artist. A desperate cry for connection with a world that is deaf to my soul. Why would you paint these, by the way? Oh, we have a water monster now, do we? Uh, I gotta jump onto that barrel, I guess. It's right on top of it, so we gotta wait. Ow! Okay, so it's not an insta-kill, just like amnesia, I guess. I forgot I had this. I'm gonna keep this up. Aha! Too slow, buggeroo. There's a power thing there. I guess that's to shut the gate, right? Should we try it? I feel like he's gonna be too quick. Nope, that turned off power? Why? Why would I do that? That seems like a terrible idea. Just go! Oh, there's no way it wouldn't be able to kill me here. Maybe I had to turn off the power to get access this. No power. Okay. Let's get power. I just get a crowbar? Huh? I'm pretty sure I just got... Well, why did I turn the power off if I... Ooh. Ooh. Get away! You're too close. Okay, so I, I guess I gotta turn the power back on. That might have been something. I was a little preemptive with that. I saw a big green switch. Had to press it. Can't blame me for that. Oh god. Oh god! Ouch! <laughs> Stop. Stop hurting me. I don't like it. You need to go that way. Get away. I don't know which one lights more. The glow stick or this? Or... I mean, glow stick, obviously, right? Hui! Ooh! Ah! Uh-oh. My screen is very red. That's not good. Oh, it went away. So maybe it's uh, regenerating. I guess I gotta turn the power back on. I can just keep jumping and it's not gonna get me. Well, that makes it things a little easier. The power is currently on. I'm pretty sure this would kill me. I just want to say that now, but oh well. Something is missing. Okay, so I picked up something. I guess it's for the first room. There might have been something else back there. Can I just keep jumping and he's not going to get me? I'm cheesing it! You can't get me! Haha! -ha. There's another path there. Let's go this way. Or is this where I started? No, it's not. Ah, valve! Gotcha. Very nice. I'm right, going to get on this so we can... Ah, 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 ah. No. Shoo. 
Keep jumping. And that makes the things a little easier for sure. Very nice. Let's go ahead and do this now. Oh! I think I jumped a little too far. Okay, so there is a checkpoint system at least. Okay, let me get back to the switch and collect everything. I'll be one sec. Alright, let's turn this power off. Jump on this barrel. Get away, monster man. Oi! So I guess I turned the power off to get past this and do something with that. Power's still on, even though the gate is open. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You gotta give me a second, man. Like, I, I don't know why you're in such a rush to murder me. What have I done for to you? Huh? Am I, like, an evil person? Could be. Ow. hoo -ya. Oh, but the gate closed again. Was I supposed to be faster? Could be it. Maybe I was... Oh, I could just do this. No. Okay, I just have to be quick. Well, I guess that's what the jumping is for. Here we go. Keep jumping, keep jumping. Out. Never stop. Keep going. Ooh. Okay, let's see if it's a time thing. Do I have to use it a second time? Ah, crowbar, you say. Well, well, well. I, I, I did the. Uh, it was a little weird that I didn't use it beforehand, but here we are. No, you need to stop hurting me, my good sir. I see now what I must do. All right. So what does that do for me? Next level. Okay. Much less terrifying than the other creature that was going. Whatever noise I made. Thanks for playing the demo. If you'd like to add the game to your wish list and join our community to stay up to date with all the news about Strashna Two. Okay, click to continue just to see what happens. Actually, any button. Let me hit the letter U. Main menu. Okay. That was insanely fun, I'm going to admit. Not the scariest thing in the world, maybe because I wasn't really taking it seriously, but the entertainment side with the radios and doing your own voices doesn't really help with that. But it's so much fun. Uh, it's one of the most unique things I've played. Not many games let you use your voice. A lot of things let you use your microphone, but definitely not anywhere near like this. This was hilarious, and you can really do whatever you want with it, which is such a nice touch. Uh, I loved it. It does have the scariness there when it needs to be, and I just really enjoyed this demo. And there's so much to look at. There's so much to do. A lot of story. It's just a really, really good demo. So guys, this game is expected to release in quarter one of 2025. So if you want me to play this, let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know what your thoughts were on this demo. I had a lot of fun and I hope you guys did as well. Thank you so much for watching. And if you did enjoy the video, why not leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you can see more horror games like this every day. And I will see you in the next one. Time, wake up now.